it's just a, it's a little platform and there's just a, just a little rectangular rock sitting there. It's called the rock. I think they got it from the Arkansas River that kind of separates the two of us, you know, Fort Gibson and Hilldale. I've actually played in the rivalry since I was a freshman. And so I've kind of experienced more than anyone else. And you know, out of all the games, you know, district championships or anything like that, the Hilldale Fort Gibson rivalry is also every game, I remember every game more than I remember any other game. Just because it's, there's so much intensity. It doesn't matter, you know, which team is, you know, if Fort Gibson is so much for better in Hilldale this year or Hilldale is so much for better in Fort Gibson this year. It's always a close game. You don't know who's gonna win until the clock is zero. Like our fans, and I'm sure theirs, you know, a lot of them, that's the only game they care about. You know, even though you play nine other games throughout the season, the regular season, but a lot of people just are concerned with, with how you do in that game. In the last two years, we beat them, so uh, we've had it. So, you know, we played them last year over there, and, and we had to take it with us. Uh, but we brought it home. So. <laughs> Each team is also another tradition. Each team, whoever wins it, you take a rock. You take the rock to the middle of the field and you take pictures with your whole team. No matter if, you know, if Fort Gibson wins it at Hilldale or Hilldale wins it at Fort Gibson, it doesn't really matter. You know, you're going to take a picture of that rock on the, your home field or their home field. It's, I mean, it's, it's what high school football is all about when, you, when you're talking about a big rival. Awesome. Yeah. It's great. Yeah. 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 Yeah.